Hi, my name is Max Garview, and part of what I do here at Virginia Tech is study earthquake producing geological faults. These are incredibly important to understand because as we know, earthquakes can cause a lot of damage and problems, especially to people um, in highly populated areas. Uh, so to better understand geological faults, let's take a look at this landscape model to my left. The backside here represents a desert uh, mountain ridge with valleys and drainages that lead and flow into the flat basin floor here. Where these two landscapes meet happens to be where the geological fault is. A geological fault is essentially a weakness in the Earth's crust that accumulates stress over time from outside sources. And eventually that stress leads to the failure of the geological fault, allowing for movement on either side. This is what is called an earthquake, and we can simulate that with my model here. Okay, so maybe it's not as uh, dramatic as what the real thing would be, but um, probably the most fun part of my job is actually going out to faults very much like this one in Southern California in the Mojave Desert and trying to assess how active they may be. Um, and so one way we can try to do that is by mapping and collecting data. We can try to realign features such as these deposits here. And that will actually tell us something about how active the fault is and maybe how hazardous, hazardous it is to the surrounding populations. Um, that's all I have for you. Thank you for listening.